Building a corner is a very simple procedure. To begin, you have to determine how high you would like the corner to be. If you would like the corner to be 11 courses high, you need five brick on one side and six brick on the other. In this picture, as you can see, I'm using a steel uh, angle to make sure that I lay the corner out to have a 90 degree angle. After you determine where you're going to place the corner, the next step is to dry lay it. In this picture, I'm using a roller to make an equal amount of spacing between each brick. And for this corner, I'm building it nine courses high, so I have five brick going in one direction and four brick in the other. This is the proper way to start the course to make sure that all the spacing is even and give it the strongest bonds that it could possibly have. After dry bonding the one side, now as you can see in the picture, I'm dry bonding the other sh side to make sure that it's equal on both sides. In the next picture, as you can see, I'm leveling the corner brick and the end brick. This, pr this is the procedure that needs to be done to make sure that the corner is level even if the ground beneath it is not. In this picture, I'm doing the same to the other side of the corner as to what I did to the other side to make sure that overall the whole entire corner is level. In this picture, I'm using my level to make sure that the whole corner is level by leveling the end brick and the other end brick to make sure that everything is level. In the next picture, I take a brick and lay it on top of my outer edge corner to make sure that it is perfectly plumb. This is called pointing the corner. In this picture, I'm using a cylindrical striker to strike the corners to compress the mortar and all the mortar joints which makes sure moisture cannot seep into the crevices of it which keeps it lasting a lot longer than it would if you did not strike it. Finally the last step in making a corner is to make sure that you take your level and then align it with each of the courses on the corner and make sure that they are all plumb with each other to make sure that the corner overall is plumb to itself.